What's with all these people here? Carol's over there. The Dawn protected this city from the Empire. He protected our honor. Even if we're the only ones helping, we owe it to the Dawn to protect the city. Hold your horses. Settle down, all of you. What's all this commotion? We've heard that a group from Polistrale has been spotted near Heliord. Their leader got killed thanks to a mistake of one of our own. It's only natural they'd want to talk about the incident. Once they learn the Dawn's left town, things could get ugly. We must defend the city from them until Dawn returns. You fools. If y'all weren't so eager to fight, the Dawn wouldn't have had to leave in the first place. Soon as they learn there's fighting between guilds, don't you think the Knights are bound to stick their noses in our business again? Dongrest is independent from the Empire. The Imperial Knights are in no place to tell us what to do. The Friendship Treaty still ain't finalized yet, you know. Eerie! Everyone, what do we do? This is gonna become a war between guilds if we don't do something! If only the Dawn were here. They say that the Dawn may have gone to the Leviathan's Claw Compound, the Manor of the Wicked. What? Really? Well, probably so. We were about to see if we could go there. Want to come with us? But there's a chance that the Dawn's not there, right? Yeah, it was just the old man's intuition, after all. If he's not there, war could break out while we're out looking for him. Yuri, what should we do? What would be best? Well, we should be able to handle the manner of the wicked ourselves. You go ahead and do what you think you should do. Yeah. Then I'm gonna go and talk to everyone. Do you think this is the right choice? We don't have much choice. We can't follow the Dawn and guard the city at the same time. I hope that we find the Dawn at the Manor of the Wicked. We're his backup. If Jaeger's the one Dawn's up against, he'll need all the help he can get. Hey! You even know where you're going? It's straight to the west of here. Hey! Wait for me! I'm guessing this is the Manor of the Wicked. It's so heavily guarded. We should wait and see what the situation is like first. Can't get too comfortable, though. Shh, they're arguing about something. What part of let us in are you having trouble with? Like I said, your timing just seems a little too perfect. Don't you have anything to prove who you say you are? You know what? Actually, we don't. Let us through. The Dawn is here. We don't have time to sit and chat. So, the old man did come here. Bingo! This is our chance to listen in. Didn't you go looking for proof that the Hunting Blades were after that Dragon Rider? I told you, we received word that the Dawn was headed here before we could arrive at Mount Temza. We couldn't very well ignore news like that, could we? The Hunting Blades are out to get Judy? What are you waiting for? You won't be any use to Jaeger if we have to give you a beating. Hmm. We'll let you through, but not without an escort. You don't mind, I hope. Whatever, just let us in. What luck! Now there's less guards to worry about. Guess we better strike while the iron's hot. Wh who the hell are you? Hey! Nice, Rapid. I think we're still in the clear. So let's make with the getting inside. Why do you think the Hunting Blades would be after Judith? If they're looking for Epithea, maybe they want the dragon she was riding. If he's an Entelechea, he might become an Epithea like Bellius. I mean, when he dies. Which means Harry's request wasn't the only reason they wanted to take Bellius down. They want those Apatheas something bad. Judy! Judy might be in trouble, but we should help the Dawn out first. Especially with those two charming young ladies in there. Aye, let's be quick and clean this place up. Sure, we should be on our way. I'm just worried about Judith. So you'll be going to Mount Timza? But the Dawn... 
We're practicing deciding for ourselves, remember? Let's move. I'm coming too! She'd be upset if I left the dawn like this to go looking for her. I can just hear her saying, My, what did you think you were doing? Don't worry about that, lady. She's tough. All right, let's get the old dawn out of this place. Looks like we found one more thing we can't ignore. Okay. L look White horse. That's the dawn? Stand back. Didn't you say Leviathan's Claw would never try something like this, old man? The Dawn's the one that started all this! What? Then that means the old man's... Just what do you think you're doing here, you damn fools? Bringing young ones to a place like this? Bravo! I really should thank you for such a heart-rending performance. What the hell's he talking about? Gah, get out of the way! Where's the Don? He's gone after Jaeger. Let's go. I never dreamed you'd try anything this risky. I finally made up my mind that this mud ball would be a much prettier place without you on it. The other Master Guilds surely won't like you ignoring the Union's laws for your personal vendetta. And I'll face the consequences. But it's daybreak now. Looks like I've underestimated your touch. I'm out of time. If I don't get myself back to Dongrest, those fools gonna start a war with each other. Oh, I think it's a bit late to prevent that little accident from happening. A couple of eggs might have to be broken, but I'm prepared to pay a price. A price. You still got us to deal with, Jaeger. Well, it looks like the tide's taken a turn. Yeah, indeed. Bye-bye. Hey, wait! Damn, that guy's a regular vanishing act. Now what's with all of you? Just how you figure coming down here be the smart thing to do? Hmm? Who's that little kid? No little kid. I'm Patty. I'm sorry about that. Patty, huh? Why don't you come over here and show me your face? Now this is a surprise. Huh? You're a dead ringer for Eifried. The very spitting image. Huh? Then it really is true that Patty is Eifried's granddaughter? Granddaughter? You're his huh. I never heard nothing about that scoundrel having a granddaughter. Huh, so Patty's guess was right on the mark. As his relative, I bet you must have suffered quite a bit over Eifried's infamous incident. I've got my own reasons for following Eifried's trail. I thought that since you were his friend, Don, you might know something. <laughs> It'd be an exaggeration to say that we were ever friends. He just did whatever he wanted to do. I never knew where he was or what he was doing. And I ain't got a clue about that now, either. I see. Haven't you met him somewhere recently? Hmm, have I? Can't rightly say. This is a keepsake left by an ally of yours. We were asked to bring it to you. <sighs> Looks like I caused you all some trouble. Of all the... Why'd she have to wind up like this? Just what is an apatheia, anyway? Well, you see... Hmm. Afraid I don't have time to explain it now. Uh, I hate to cut and run, but I'll leave the rest of these guys to you. Wait. We should think about getting out of here, too. Hey, let me try and buy the old man some time. Raven? Come on. Guess we'd better. I think it's about time. I agree. You don't mean... from up here? Ah!
I got a bad feeling about this. We should get back to Dongrist. Yuri! It's terrible! The Union and Polystrolli are squaring off against each other with Hope Bone Blastia! The Dawn is back, but something's not right! So, he made it back in time. Looks like my hunch was right, though. What do you mean, your hunch? He's been planning for this to end in his death all along. What? Why would he want to do something like that? To... set things right? Bellius died because of Harry's rash behavior. She's the Duce of Nordopolica. You can't just say, sorry, I got some bad information. Which means there's gotta be compensation to make up for losing Bellius. So the price Don mentioned back at the Manor of the Wicked was... His own life. Once he made up his mind to sacrifice himself, taking down Jaeger wasn't a problem. Even if it meant going against the laws. No! He can't do that! There has to be some other way. Both sides are at the breaking point, though. This thing could go off at the drop of a hat. And if it starts, it'll mean all-out war between the Union and Polistrale. I'm not sure we have the time to find some other way. <sighs> I'm going with Carol. Hang in there, kid. You're a boss now, right? But it's like there's nothing I can do on my own. So then ask for help. That's what friends are for, right? Don! Take good care of them. They'll be there whenever you need them. <sighs> I'm coming with you. Like hell you are! Well, old man, it's been fun. Raven, you better nail Jaeger for me. <laughs> That's a heavy load for somebody like me. <laughs> You're the only one I can ask. White Horse. Little lady, try going underground through the storeroom in the city's tavern. Hmm. There's a wall there inscribed with Eifried's name. If you're his granddaughter, it ain't a bad idea to take a glimpse at the kind of things he did and how he lived. <sighs> We're so grateful for everything your darling grandson's done to us. Really. The boy has made a mess of things. He may be my idiot grandson, but he's also a full member of the Union. And it falls upon any leader to take responsibility for the mistakes of their people. So say the laws. Take me, then. Let my head atone for Bellius. Don. Idiot. These guilds, they're all filled with nutcases. So, who's going to be my second? It would be my honor. Guess you're stuck doing a job nobody much wants. You too. <laughs> no kidding. Yuri, I was looking forward to watching you go places. <laughs> I'll make sure to save you a spot in hell. I don't think they'd let me into the hell you're going to. <laughs> I won't forget that attitude, boy. And I won't forget your resolve, Don Whitehorse. Don! Listen up. You all gotta stand on your own two feet from here on. There's a new age coming, so get out there and make it for yourselves. Everyone here seems to have calmed down. Feels more like they're expecting the end of the world. Carol's been taking the Dawn's passing pretty hard, too. And it looks like things are keeping the old man busy. I guess it comes with being a member of Altosk. Huh. I haven't seen Patty for a while now. She might be in the sewer tunnels. Oh, right. That's what the Dawn was talking about. He gave up his own life to make amends for what happened. The guilds take their laws pretty seriously. 
The pride of living by the laws of the Guild. Taking responsibility. Accepting the choices he'd made. The Don practiced what he preached. And he was willing to stake his life on those beliefs. Responsibility. Choices. I've got to get these things figured out myself. Best to start with our guild, with Brave Vesperia. Yuri? Where are you? Just going for a walk. He probably went looking for Carol. Carol. Yuri. I... There wasn't anything I could do. The Dawn... And all the rest of you, you'd all made up your minds and did what you could. Nobody in this town's gonna listen to anything I've got to say. So I was thinking I should try talking with Paula Strale instead. But they might be done talking, and just attack anyway. When I thought that, I... I was too scared to go alone. So I ended up not going at all. I'm not good for anything. What about Judy? Weren't you gonna look for her? I can't. I can't go with you anymore, Yuri. I'm just not cut out to be the boss of a guild. Is that it, then? Is that all guilds and brave Vesperia mean to you? Just walking away from the dream like that? But I wanted to be the best guild! To be useful to the Dawn! For him to notice me! He's been a role model for me. And now he's not around. <laughs> so you're just gonna pack it up and quit? Just what was it the Dawn died for? You of all people should know the answer to that. You can always do everything you want, Yuri. You never understand how I feel. I'm not tough like you. There's no way I can be like you and the Dawn. It's over. Our guild is... Carol! Don't you remember all the Dawn told you? Did you forget his resolve? As a member of our guild, I'm going to Mount Timza to find Judy. Huh? Brave Vesperia will go on. Even if you don't, this guild is more than just you now. <laughs> I don't want to run away. I don't want to, but... 